Auf. Yes, 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 I know. I know it's been like weeks, weeks in. I haven't done anything since the fire. Your place has been burnt to the ground. I know, I know. But, I mean, look, there's eight units here that are still perfectly okay. No damage whatsoever. Is it my fault you guys were all deciding to live in these burnt-out units? No. Pick up your stuff, move into the other units, okay? And I will get to fixing this when I'm well and ready to fix it, okay? You understand me? I am the boss here, not you. You will listen to me. I am the law. And the law. Ah! Ah! I'll have it done by the end of the day. Yeah. Welcome, everybody. <laughs> Did another episode of Murder's Place Minecraft. So I've upgraded. I didn't actually mean to. I didn't want to, because I knew the, about the item frame thing. So I thought I was running 14W03B, so I loaded that up. But when I loaded that up, a bunch of the item frames popped off the wall. So I was like, what? So I was like, all right, well, maybe it was this one. So I loaded up 14 whatever this one. 14OB, 14O4B. And the rest of them <laughs> popped off the walls, so... Yeah, I lost um, probably some stuff, but um, here's a lot of it. Or this was just stuff I had on me, I guess. So today, we're going to work on the village. I don't think we'll need the beacons, but maybe we'll put those away. I'm going to grab some of this polished andesite. Chisel stone? Sure. Sure. Granite? Yes. And general stone blocks would be useful. The rest of this I will probably just clean up after. I'll take some of it. All right. And an arrow. Good. Good. Now, do I have any more of those blocks? I do. Granite, andesite, diorite. All right. And we can make more of it if we want with this cobble. And, okay, yeah, there's some more stuff that I managed to pick up. Uh, one was this one, which was good. So, yeah, that was on the wall here for the quap. So I did manage to pick that up. So that is something I did not want to lose. I probably did lose some of the armor pieces and swords that were on my chests up there. But they were garbage items anyway, pretty much. Okay, but I thought I went quartz hunting. Did I not do that in this world? <laughs> Which world was it? Yeah, it's this one. Okay. So we have plenty of quartz, so we could um, throw that into the co-op there. And, oh, I'm very bad at um, things with my channel. <laughs> I'm okay at, you know, make videos and what have you. But when it comes to, you know, uh, landmarks and stuff like that, I'm not very good. So I have reached 2,000 subscribers, so I wanted to say thank you guys, and I've been meaning to say thank you guys for a while now, but, you know, I just keep forgetting to do it, and then the episode's over, and then I remember afterwards, and I'm like, damn it, next time, I'll do it next time. So yeah, thank you very much, guys, I've reached 2,000 subs, and yeah, I owe it all to you guys. All I do is record, you guys help my channel grow. So thank you, and I'm just going to leave it at that. All right, so I guess we'll do this. I got a little bit here. I have an idea. So our village burnt down, right? And I didn't run a load of backup because I'd already done a whole bunch of stuff. So we're just going to deal with it. And I tried to do a little silly thing with the in intro. So hopefully you enjoyed that. But yeah, essentially exactly half of this thing burnt to the ground, it seems. Pretty much half of it. But the other half still perfectly okay. And yeah, the villagers are stupid and they hang out in the, <laughs> the destroyed ones. But that's okay. So what we're going to do is redo it, but in stone. So um, I like this stuff. I don't know if that's where that goes. I'm trying to line it up here. 
No, I guess it's one more block over. Uh, there's that. So it's probably here. Oops. So what I'm thinking is, yeah, this stuff, the various ones of this. Get out of the way, please, sir. I'm trying to repair your home. Kind of looks like stucco. If you guys are familiar with stucco. Or kind of like a concrete-ish look to it. You know, where they take a... Crap, what do you call them? Shovel? Not a shovel. A trowel? Truss? No. Truss in your home. Trowel. I think it's a trowel. You take a trowel, spackle, and all that. You know. So I think that might be an interesting new look. And we could kill that spider very soon because he's annoying. And I don't want him to be alive anymore. We could also use this stuff, which I think actually looks kind of cool too. And with the same kind of effect. It's a little harsher, but still has an interesting I idea. And what I did before is I kind of separated it. The top was a different color, so I think I want to do that again too. Please don't hit the iron golem. So we could have like gray down here, or I think I want to go with this red. And I assume that is where the wall is, right? So let's just go peek over here. Um, all these suites were identical, so for the most part. So it's hard to tell, but I guess if the door is there, was the door on the outer? Oops. Um, no. I need that. I don't have much of it yet. I'll have to go mass produce some. Uh, let's see. Yeah, the doors are all on the outer side. So if that's where the door is over here, that means there used to be um, some stairs right there. Okay. So what I think I want to do is do some red down here up to... Right there. Okay. Get rid of you and go get my... Oh, I don't have my axe. I'm a failure. And then we'll do that. I'll probably pause here and go get some more material. And then I can go find my tools. Oops. And start a timer. Turn on my brain. Okay. And then from here... Do I go up one more? Should I go up one more? No, at the level of this, it is this color. So we'll probably do something like that. And then to the roof. Are we to the roof yet? No, to the roof. And then we'll see. Now from here, I might do like a strip of this, I guess. And we're not going to go too fancy with this build, like detail-wise. I don't want to make it too 3D-ish or anything like that. So it is still going to be a relatively flat build. But I think something like that. Um, and then, yeah, I'd fill this in as well. So this becomes the white stucco-ish type deal. Concrete, whatever you call it. What do you put on the side of your house? It is stucco. Yeah. Stucco. Commercial grade stucco. So something as simple as that. This guy will probably be granted a window now. I don't know why there wasn't one before, but we'll give him a window. Maybe some beacon lighting. I don't know. That spider must be underground. Either that or he's just on the other side of the wall. So that's not too bad. We might try to do something with the detail. Hi, dog. You, you gotta shake your head like that right now. Right when I'm recording. Inconsiderate. Mm -hmm. I told you I was recording. I said I'm recording. Do not get up. And shake your head. And he did it anyway. He's out to get me. Don't tell anyone. Okay, let me go get some stuff. You're in the sewer, aren't you? I know it. I know it. You're always in the sewer. There's always one. Oh, there you are. Hey, guy. Now, where'd you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Got night, Joe. Yeah, he probably just spawned in here somewhere. Must be somewhere that's dark. Darkness. Ooh, what's this? Let's put those back. Okay, so I believe they've nerfed the way I farmed those 64 beacons 
the panda method of pushing a wither into the ceiling Yoink. to adjust the headphone to avoid beard noise, hopefully. But yeah, I don't think you can push the wither anymore while he's charging up to go, so that no longer works. So we will have to do this the legitimate way. Hmm. I just look in here. I want to see if we can work in a clay. I thought maybe orange, but orange not so good. Something that goes with the granite. Let's get rid of this middle strip of another brick and put down some of this. And then we can see which ones go nicely with it and which ones do not. So most of these go decent with it, actually. These four here, the grays and the whites. I mean, they... Some better than others. That one actually looks really good. So that's white. It's gray. That doesn't look too bad. Orange does look pretty awful. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, any of the reds, I don't like. The brown, yes. Blues, no. Green, no. What's under here? Just more of that. Okay. So those, those are all the clay. All right, let's try something else. Um, I know white. I mean, they're all probably going to look okay with the white. So let's do the andesite instead. And because it's gray, I guess kind of everything goes with it anyway. So that's kind of pointless. And then if I, I do do the white, do do for the fun of it. Sure, let's do that one. Yeah, it's white. So I mean, everything goes with white. Okay. All right. So white clay, I think, is what I want, not orange. I do have some white, so I can get rid of the orange. And I have some cyan. So it's looking a little plain there, but I did make some more blocks. But I thought maybe we could add in some other blocks. So I see... I've started watching Arcus. And I used to watch him a bit. And he's very good at building. And he's got some interesting build techniques. But he often does little patches of various blocks in a wall to give it various depth so that it doesn't all look kind of the same. So I'm going to try to do that here. I don't know how well I can pull it off and I don't know if this is the way to do it with this material. Okay, having one by itself looks kind of weird I think so let's not do that. Let's try to do not one by itself. Again we'll do maybe that. Who knows if that will work. Uh, some more Tetris. Okay <laughs> this will be the Tetris building. Alright and where's the back wall? That is the back wall. Okay, so from here we're going to rip that out anyway, and we're going to put in the polished versions up to this point, and then we'll switch to the polished white. Or maybe we'll do gray? I don't know. Maybe the gray with the that in the middle, and then we can mix up the regular crushed stuff like that with this gray, and maybe that will look kind of cool. Okay, so let's remove this. Yoink, yoink. Do I have anything else to talk about? Probably. I always forget. I should start really making a list before I record of things that I may want to talk about because I don't remember. It was a sub thing. Some stuff I try to talk about just in Olympus. Other stuff um, I try to reserve for my single player. So I think my single player is currently my most popular series. So that is where, um, should we do this? So yeah, that's probably the best place to do most of the talking. So yeah, here now we can maybe, you can hear my mouse. Whenever I'm trying to break just one button, or one block, I tend to click quite a bit. So this will probably end up looking better than that. So what we will might try to do is, I will keep the framing as the stone, and maybe I'll... Maybe I'll keep the brick outline, but I'll just also work in some brick in the center. And we'll see how that works, if it looks good or not. So let's do maybe three together there. And here I think I can do singles without any problem. Um, let's get rid of all those. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Uh, wrong one. Okay. 
And then that should probably all be like that. Why not? Okay. Okay, okay. Cool. Not bad. Should there be an overhang? I guess not. There's going to be this stairwell up. So all that will have to be redesigned too to look kind of stonish. So this, it's all going to be <laughs> converted from a nice warm wooded feeling to this cold <laughs> stone stone look but that's okay uh we'll see okay so if i get rid of that let's try just okay let's put that down that down let's try just doing that any other changes okay so they reverted the whole iron golem change so that is back to normal so iron golem farm should be up and running i haven't really check to see if it has been but it should be so that's cool i might still move them i might keep move the kill chamber over to uh that looks kind of neat it's looking a little weird though just flat but maybe once the stairs in place again it won't look so bad so we'll have to wait and see and i'll have to see what we want to do about the doorways because it's not going to be completely the same unless i add a stripe back <laughs> But that might be the way to go, just a, a mixture. And then I'm not sure about the stone. Um, possibly. What if we try while you're here? Give you guys lots of little versions to see, and you can let me know which one you like the best. But I will probably finish this off camera, or do the most of it off camera. And you guys can check it out next episode on how it all progressed. So it's kind of mostly just the planning phase. So yeah, we could do that. It's not too bad. And again, it might be better once there's stairs because it looks weird there. I would really like to punch that out a block to create some overhang. But with the staircase here, that's not a good idea. So I'm going to resist the urge to do that and just keep going. And then, yeah, there'll be overhang here on the front side. So that will help take care of that. Am I seeing a zombie over there? No, that's a leaf. It's just a leaf. <laughs> I'm afraid. Ooh, a leaf. You know what movie that's from? It's the best movie. It's a Disney movie. It's animated. It's fantastic. Feel free to guess in the comments below if you know what I'm talking about. So the other problem with this is it's going to make the inside of the houses look really derpy. So I don't know. We might... We might. Let's look at the inside. Okay, let's um, get rid of those. We'll probably add some carpets. But what I'm thinking is we could actually make this a really skinny house and have at least the outer walls. So we could layer this with something else. This is what I'm saying. Spit it out, Merlis. Spit it out. So we could do that for the outer walls. So you come in, this suite will probably be a little bit smaller than this one because this one will have only the back wall that needs to have a block in front of it. So in the end, these suites will end up being a little bit different. But I think we could use the clay, actually, and we can use various different colors of clay <laughs> and treat them as paint. Is this where you want to live? Okay. Perfectly fine houses over there. Perfectly fine, no damage, functioning doors, nice tree, but no, you want to live in a hole in the ground. Whatever. Whatever. And actually, I have a, a future change for this, some redstone addition that I want to do, but I'll save that for another episode. But yeah, we'll work here again to do that. So I think <laughs> this is going to turn into like a prison. It's going to be hilarious. Um, let's see. There, there. No, okay. We don't need that there. This goes here. However, let's just see if we can get a front going. So before, this was a little archway. Do I want to do that again? Maybe. We could either use stone or we'll probably try to incorporate some wood. Maybe some dark oak or some kind of wood here as a stair. Or maybe even just keep the spruce there. I'm not too sure. Um, I didn't grab my axe. I'm not even sure where it is, to be honest. I might have thrown it into a chest when I was trying to pick up all those items, or it might be somewhere else. Um, let's see. 
you can go back there with a bed and a fence post. Okay. All right. So let's pretend it's stone, or let's see what we can do with stone. And actually, this is supposed to overhang one more, isn't it? Yeah, the actual overhang comes out one more, so we could do that. And I did not turn off my Skype. I don't know if you guys can hear it. If you can, I apologize. I apologize. I'm sorry. Apologize to that man. Apologize to that man. Sorry. I'm just going to have to throw movie quotes at you every three seconds. So that could be the new home. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I like it. Sure, whatever. Got walls. Perfect. Okay. So. And then I guess back here there'll be more of this. More of this stuff. So let's see here. Let's get rid of you. Maybe. No. Now it'd be nice in a new world because this stuff does spawn naturally. So it would be nice to. Let me go hop in one of those. I'm sorry! Don't jump in front of me like that, okay? I was just trying to get up here. Sleep in this bed under the night sky. But yeah, it would be nice. I think it's fairly abundant, so if <laughs> if you were just in a world, new world with it, you could find a decent amount of it. Alright, so that'll be like that, and then I think I brought some half slabs. So I'll either put... let's see... I can either put half slabs like that, which is a little derpy, but at least it prevents spawnage. Or we bring it up one higher, so it depends what we like to see there. I'm going to grab that out again, and you. Okay, so there's supposed to be an overhang here. Okay, the overhang is right there. Now, the downside of using this stuff is there's no, like, stair that I can really use. So, um, I'm not sure what we're going to do about that. Okay, and that'll be a window. Will it? Okay, so maybe that should be framed. And frame it that way as well. Hmm. Okay, well, it's got some something going for it, I guess. Might change that block, not sure. Okay, what can we do for a overhang? Uh, it won't be wood anymore either, so we'll probably bring out the diorite again. And bring that across. And then for the walkway, it'll probably be changed to some kind of stone. So you guys are getting an upgrade, sort of. Okay, that looks a little weird. Uh, I think it's supposed to be the andesite instead. That might look more appropriate, since that's what we're branching off of. My inventory, you guys, is full. But that's okay. We're nearly done for today. And I'm going to do a whole bunch of work on here, probably. I'll play around with what we've got working here, but feel free to let me know, because I probably actually won't work on it right away. I might wait until the video goes up, and then, then I'll work on it after I've had the chance to hear from you guys and let me know what you think. So a totally different look, but I think it might be cool. might be interesting. It's going to look very commercial, opposed to very residential, I guess, in my opinion. But, yeah, I think we could do something with it and that style. And then, yeah, we got something else in store for this place later on. What do you guys got, anyway? How you doing? You got Shepard, you got... You're doing your stuff. So I, I think most of these converted them. Ooh. We've, ooh. Hi. <laughs> How are you? My name is Marilibus. I can provide you with all the flesh that you could ever want. Not mine, mind you. Mine has to stay on my body. But, others, I'm okay with peeling it off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right? All right. Shall we say goodbye? Let's say goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you for watching today's episode. And we'll see you next time.